Hey guys, in this video I'm going to address another problem that may occur when you are trying to graph on your TI-84 Plus CE and similar models such as the TI-84 Plus Silver Edition. This is one video in my calculator tutorial series, so be sure to check out other videos in the series. Without further ado, let's get to it. If I press the Y equals button, as of right now you'll see that I have Y1 equals X squared. If I press graph, you see that I receive an error message that says error invalid dimension. Press enter to quit. Now once again let's press y equals. Notice that plot 1 is highlighted. To turn that off, arrow up to plot 1 once the cursor is blinking on plot 1 press enter to turn it off and now if I arrow down plot 1 is no longer highlighted check for other plots too as they may be on and cause similar issue now if I go back to graph I get my graph it is worth mentioning that if I had numbers or data points for plot 1 it would graph those points in the, uh, in the graph instead of uh, giving me the error message. For example, uh, let's go to uh, second y equals to choose stat plot. I'm going to go to plot one, so just uh, press enter. Uh, you notice that the x list is L1 and the y list is L2. I just want to see that, so now I'm going to press stat which takes me to this screen and I'm going to select edit so just press enter and now I see the lists L1, L2, L3 and so on uh, and I already saw that L1 are the x values for uh, st uh, the stat plot 1 and L2 uh, is the y values so I'm going to just type in a few random values just to show you what happens when you have values in for the plot so L1 I'm going to type in 1 and then press enter 2 enter 3 enter and now I'm going to arrow over to L2 I'm going to type in uh, just a few values 2 enter 5 enter 6 enter and I'll just leave it at that and now if I go back to y equals and I, if I go and turn the plot uh, 1 on again uh, by pressing enter now you notice that I have a, a y1 equals x squared and I also have a plot 1 turned on if I press graph notice that I get my parabola but I also get those points from stat 1 so just be careful of those I hope this video was helpful. If you haven't already, please subscribe. If you have any questions, as always, feel free to leave them in the comment section. You can also follow my channel on Facebook and post questions there. Check out other videos on my channel, especially the calculator tutorial series. Until next time, take care guys.